today's motivational minute is on walk in expectancy. Walk in expectancy. What does that mean? Every day I go through my life, I expect to have favor in everything that I do. I expect that I am going to have a great outcome. I expect that I am going to get the upper hand. I expect that I'm going to learn something new. And I don't, I don't change that thought process. Uh, in some realms, it's called cocky, but in others, it's called confident. I feel as though if I'm not confident, then who else is going to be confident for me? If I'm not confident to know that any scenario, any setting, any room that I walk into that I can hang, that I can communicate with, that I can make sure that I am good to go, hey, there's, there's, that's who I am. And that's what I try to embody and that's what I try to make sure that those of you all that are listening, as you're growing in your success, as you're growing in your leadership, as you're growing in your listening, as you're growing in your communication, that you walk with that kind of confidence. It's awesome, it's amazing. I like to play basketball on my free time. And to this day, I'm not as in shape as I was in college, but if I play Michael Jordan, the best basketball player in the world ever to have played the game, I know for a fact that I could beat him. Now, the reality of the situation is, he's Michael Jordan, he'll dunk on me, he'll shoot threes in my face, he'll back me down, he'll probably win. But the confidence that I take going into that scenario is looking at it as if I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. That is why I do these motivational minutes. These are motivational minutes are to help give you guys tools and ideas for success. I guarantee you the Oprah's of the world, the, the Bill Gates of the world, those people don't go any scenario not expecting to have the upper hand. Now, the ex walking and expectancy takes work. You have to do your part. You have to do your research. You have to read. You have to analyze. You have to ask questions. You have to be persistent. You can't take no for an answer. And if you get a no, you have to figure out why. You have to be able to grow from those components, from those standpoints in order to make sure that you're successful. And as you walk in that expectancy, as you walk in that confidence, know for a fact that success is coming. Know for a fact that there's not any situation, there's not any scenario, there's no circumstance that comes across your path that you can't excel. I say this often and I mean it and to the bottom of my heart, I believe in you all. I believe that success is coming. I believe that success is yours for the taking. You just have to be willing to put the work in and do what's necessary to get to success. So as I challenge you today in this motivational minute, I challenge you to walk in expectancy. I challenge you to walk in expectancy and expect every scenario that you go into to work to your advantage. It's about the glass being half full or the glass being half empty. If the glass is half full, then you know that you're on the right path. But if you're negative and you're pessimistic and you're doubting, at the end of the day, if you don't think you can do something, who else does or who else will? At the end of the day, if you don't know for a fact that you can be successful, who else is going to feel that for you? Who else is going to reinforce you to know that you can and will be successful? So for today's Motivational Minute, I challenge you to step it out. Walk in expectancy. Change your mindset. A lot of what we talk about in these Motivational Minutes is changing your mindset. You can do it. I know that you can, I believe in you, and I trust that you can. And as you listen to these motivational minutes, go to my website, danielpferguson.com. I've got former motivational minutes, so if you miss them, you can definitely tune in. You can definitely check them out. But these are here for your development. For those that want a more in-depth development, go to that website, danielpferguson.com. Check out my career coaching. In those sessions, we dig deeper with what you want to do and how you want to get there. You've seen people without any talent who have had material success and fame based solely on drive. 100%. It's all about knowing that you can get and have whatever you put your hands to do. So check out my website, danielpferguson.com. Tomorrow, guys, tune in. If you are a woman, if you are a wife, if you are a mom, my wife is going to be joining my Periscope tomorrow, and we're going to be talking about goal setting. Her website is fitmomfergie.com fitmomfergie.com. She has a 50 plus weight loss pound or 50 plus pound weight loss journey after the birth of our second kid. 
She looks amazing. She's phenomenal. I love her. She's gorgeous. And she is tuning in with me. She's joining me on our Periscope tomorrow. So be sure to tune in tomorrow. I'll send out a tweet about 30 minutes before we go live so that way you guys can know. But thank you all for joining today's Periscope. I truly, truly appreciate it. Again, I challenge you to step it out and walk in expectancy. Know that everything and anything that you do, you can have. Don't doubt it, but know and believe in your heart that you can have it and it's yours. Thank you for adding me. Thank you for adding me and following me on, on, on Periscope. Show me some love real quick. Show me some quick love. I'm about to sign off. Show me some love. Show me some love. Give me some hearts. Give me some hearts. Give me some hearts. Come on, 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 come on. All right, I appreciate you guys. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you. And as I sign off, don't forget, words bring life. Speak them into existence. Your greatness is waiting. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Please join, please share, please watch the replays, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for the hearts. Have a good day.